depend on how you can identify your root pattern please understand i'll remind once more to all of you only when you give your listening i can help you any transmission of knowledge energy or experience happens between us only when you give listening even vedic rishi starts with shrunvandu vishve amritasya putraha o sons of immortality please listen to me शृण्वंदु विश्वे अमृतस्य पुत्राः वेदाहमेहं पुरुषं महान्तं ओ सन्स ऑफ इमार्टालिटी लिसन टू मी आइडेंटिफाइंग योर रूट पैटर्न आई एम डिफाइनिंग वंस मोर I am defining once more the root pattern. The first attack of any strong emotion happening in you, and imbalancing your whole cognition, imbalancing your whole cognition. giving birth to your mind the pattern you develop from that moment is root pattern please understand it can be anything as simple as your mother did not give you the cake and gave it to your brother it may be as simple as your mother making you sit on the dining table so that you will not run around and make a mess your brother chasing you into a room and trying to beat you or you tried your best and failed in your exam or some competition it can be even that small but when a powerlessness takes you over first time in your life and your cognition is imbalanced mind is born the pattern which you develop at the time is root pattern that is the root on which the mind is born understand if you sit with yourself even for half an hour and think through dig out you will be able to find your root pattern only thing whatever you think through continue to speak in front of the mirror without speaking your thinking will not have its clarity and depth and strength dhyan se suniye to find your root pattern you may have to speak you may have to speak in front of the mirror sit in front of the mirror comfortably whatever you think as your root pattern first time powerlessness overpowered you in your life it may be at the age of 3 or 4 or the earliest memory you remember 
sometime it would have happened in 3 or 4 but you will remember only the incident happened in 7 or 8 but what you remember start talking 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 out when you start talking you will understand please understand you will understand and suddenly you may remember the deeper root pattern which started much earlier the incidents which happened much earlier I have seen there are some people who suffer the disease of spontaneous lying the moment they open their mouth lying 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 I tell you spontaneous lying means you feel powerlessness you are inauthentic to yourself feeling powerlessness is slavery feeling powerful is freedom if you feel powerful throughout your day you are a Jeevan Mukta you are living enlightenment if you feel powerful from morning waking up to the moment you fall asleep you are a Jeevan Mukta everything has roots the way you behave the way you think way you react way you respond way you cognize why you behave the way you behave as root pattern understand whether you feel healthless or helpless or emotionally weak tired, bored, lazy, agitated, irritated, everything, all these put together, I classify as powerlessness, feeling powerless. You can live without any of this, it's a good news. Bad news is you need to work for it. I tell you, if the kids can be helped in the young age to remove their, their root pattern and not to build their root pattern, they will do wonders. I have seen, I have seen what I am doing in inner awakening, ten times more happens in engineers without my physical presence. Because they are ready to receive, kids are ready to receive. Yesterday there was a case brought in front of me, related to Gurukul. One kid was not able to handle her student. In our Gurukul we give each kid one on student. She was not able to handle and there was some confusion involving the parents, family and all that. Then it was brought to me. When they brought the few people who brought to me, they really expected that I will relieve this kid from that work. No, no, it's okay. She doesn't need to mentor. That's what they expected and they, they literally tried to pull the decision out of my mouth. I said, no. If she can't handle that child, she can't handle herself. She need to learn to handle herself. My Gurukul is not man-making education. It is God-making education. My Gurukul is God-making education. Anybody wants to be a man or woman in future, get out of my Gurukul.
this is not the place for you it's a god making education i am so happy my parents did not involve and interfere and destroy my life when i was thoroughly trained by my gurus understand if i tell you guys what all training i went through you will call that only as a torture you will call that only as torture but i am so fortunate i am grateful to my parents they did not take me away from my gurus i am going around the hill alone a small boy reading still i remember the arunagiri andadi the 100 songs on arunachala written by guhana guhana machivayar a great saint still i can repeat the whole 100 verse by heart with that book i am walking i have been asked to go around the hill every day by my heartless guru kuppamal vibudananda devi in the night i am supposed to go around because in the daytime no time i'll be sometime going to school or sitting with her and studying the vedas upanishads and the, usually in the daytime it will be hot sun so after the sunset she will tell ah now lessons are over please go around the hill and come back and sleep as if it is the next door you go and come back and sleep if i go around the hill when will i sleep because by the time i come back i have to take bath in the tank and go to the temple for suprabhadam hey hey Sh- no, shivai's lord is waking up arunachal shivai is waking up you should go and see him early morning when he wakes up so i let her run anyhow i went round every day and still i keep that as a habit still if i am staying in arunachala i'll go round the hill only then i'll come and sleep of course now for security reasons i go in the car don't go by walk but whenever i can even now i don't miss walking around the hill in the night if i have a group of disciples with me brahmacharis or brahmacharinis i'll always walk and that will be the best moment of my life the way i run the way i the high energy you can see around me one day night some 10 hyenas hyena is a animal will be very shy as alone but will attack and kill any human being if they are group children means simply they will kill simply they will kill children are the best dinner for them they will kill i was walking alone it was amavasya or just near amavasya no light dark in those days the path for going around arunachala hill was very dark a narrow road not even a road like a forest road some 10 hyenas are standing in front of me suddenly in the midnight i am all alone with just that one book of songs of arunachala from the navel sorry lower abdomen swadishtana i gave the voice arunachala i don't know whether the whole arunachala hill vibrated with that there appeared a old man with a stick drove the hyenas away they all ran away some way got saved otherwise i would not be here i'll not be sitting here i would have been sitting in their stomach within next few hours and anyhow i came back and i narrated the whole story to my guru vibhudananda puri with a deep feeling from tomorrow i don't need to go to girip the hill rounding 
walking around the hill and after describing with all the masala and the whole thing she heard everything wow arunachala saved you and i also of course arunachala saved me no doubt next day i expected see once arunachala will come and save but how can that be a routine so next day she said ah come on go for the hill rounding i was shocked i asked what do you mean will every day arunachala come and save me she just hit at me with one question will every day ainas will come and attack you listen i asked her will every day arunachala come and save me she said will every day ainas will come and attack you that's it my mother who is always over protective of me i'm going and telling her she heard the whole thing then end of the day she asked me end of the whole story what did party tell party means my guru vibudananda puri what did she tell i said what she said then she just walked into the room into the house and said all right you go for the walking around the hill she just walked into the house and said you go now really i'm telling you it was a hit on me yes will every day ainas come and attack me then she said if every day arunachala will also will come go i tell you even now i am seeing it in my life whenever ainas come arunachala comes and protects me it may be 10 hainas or 12 hainas or 600 hainas arunachala comes and protects if i would not have gone next day for the my walk around the hill giri pradakshana i would have continued to be a human being with one divine experience because i decide to go now i am a divine being one human experience of screaming if i did not go next day i would have been a human being with one divine experience of arunachala coming and protecting me because i went now i am a divine being having only one human experience of screaming in fear nowadays i don't even need to scream and call arunachala he is there before even the hyenas come near drives them out destroys the hyenas any problem comes in the form of hyenas he takes care he protects me he drives them out do not allow root patterns to get rooted in you root thought pattern root pattern look into the root pattern of why you behave how you behave everything in existence as a root everything you do as a reason root i have a story after a long time i am start thing my way of storytelling god 
and Adam were walking through the garden of the Eden discussing various things at one point Adam exclaims God you have done a great job making Eve so beautiful amazing she is really beautiful then God says yes my son I made her beautiful so you would li- you would love her very very deeply after some time i think adam felt he has praised her too much man feels this if he has praised you too much he will give one but and he gives adam gives his but but lord you have made her not too smart you have made her dumb god said yes i made her dumb so that she would love you very very deeply of course there is a root there is a reason for every happening in the existence find out the root of your happening when you find your root pattern and complete with it you will understand your prarabdha now i'll give you the exact technique of finding your root pattern it will be great if you have the assistance of a teacher i have trained and training thousands of teachers and sanyasis the teacher himself should have found their root pattern and completed with that if you have that person helping you nothing like it that is the amazing and i also have a good news for you i'm coming up with a 10 day program just helping you to find the root thought pattern root pattern and completing it by real living it when you narrate you may remember some other earliest incident then narrate that earliest incident you remembered go deep deep the earliest incident you remember when you felt powerless in your life narrate that by completely reliving at least 10 times you will find out exact you will catch the exact words which are forming root pattern in you which are forming root pattern in you i am giving you the precise technique sit in front of the mirror i remember the earliest memory of you feeling powerless and repeat the incident remembering every word you uttered towards yourself every thought you had towards yourself if you have a person who has found his root pattern and completed his moola samskara and completed moola vasana that's the right word this is the technical word for root pattern in sanskrit moola vasana person who himself discovered the vasana his moola vasana and completed with it if he is there he will be able to guide you exactly with the root pattern you are suffering till now please understand when you started having that root pattern when you first had the powerlessness once the root pattern has started after that you never grow your age is sealed mentally 
physically you grow mentally you are sealed if you grow mentally physically your age will be sealed means you will be young forever if your mind goes on expanding getting matured ripe feeling powerful your body will be young you will be growing young look into every moment you feel powerless in your life even now don't try to escape from those moments no don't try to escape from those moments you can never escape you can never escape your root pattern the moment your root pattern is born your life is destroyed your growth is stopped only when you complete with your root pattern you come back to life again understand in your life when you complete with your root pattern life starts happening in you till you understand your root pattern and complete with it you can't be peaceful anywhere in the world a story disciple asks the master master you are the great powerful enlightened being why don't you just take me to the plane of perfect peace like kailash master replies you replies to the disciple if i take you to kailash it will no longer be peaceful unless your root patterns are completed you will corrupt and pollute disturb even kailash if your root patterns are complete you will be peaceful wherever you are listen if you are in the corporate field a ceo or you are in the human resource management hr field i tell you if you are a decision maker head of a team in a temple or ashram or corporate companies are in your business in your job i tell you please listen help yourself to find the root pattern and complete help others in your team in your company in your school in your institution in your organization help them to find their root pattern and complete with integrity and authenticity i am telling you once i helped my ashramites my swamis to find their root pattern and complete dhyana peetam has become three times more productive of course i wanted them to become 300 times more productive that is different that is my root pattern that is different which is out of completion so <laughs> but i tell you they became at least three times more productive so if you are decision maker are having workers under you head of a institution school college temple ashram organization institution company industry if you are a decision maker if you have to extract work from few people i just simply request you find your root pattern and complete help all the people around you to find their root pattern and complete i guarantee you 
the productivity will become three times more the productivity will become three times more if you want the help to help you to find the root pattern or any group of people to find the root pattern just call this number in the screen i'll send you just one of my gurukul kid the kid will help you to find your root pattern understand you will become so productive your team will become so productive because when you get out of the root pattern you will be out of begging mentality towards life you may beg for ever and ever you can never become crorepati millionaire by begging you may beg for 25 years it may look easy money but till the end you will never be millionaire with a begging mentality if you work till the end you will never be successful story the entrance of a temple a beggar was always stretching out his own hand asked and asking for alms begging one day suddenly people saw his both hands are stretched out stretching and begging they asked him what happened suddenly today you have started stretching both the hands still now you are stretching only one hand why now both hands now he said i have started one more branch you may have any number of branch by begging you will never become a millionaire same way if you are working with a begging mentality you will never be complete you will never be complete if you help somebody to find the root pattern and complete first thing you will have a integrated human being he will not cheat you she will not cheat you especially in the schools industries corporate offices where there is so much of cheating goes on in the down level down layer if you can help your subordinates to find the root pattern and complete with it you will have authentic integrated subordinates means have an i have a story the children were all lined up in cafeteria in a school for lunch at the head of the table were large pile of apples and the headmaster has posted a note on the apple tray take only one god is watching moving further along the lunch line at the other end of the table was a large pile of chocolate cookies on the chocolate cookies one child had put a small note take as much as you want because god is watching the apples no this is not going to be helping you if you have this kind of people around you if somebody completes with their root pattern first thing will happen to them is integrity and authenticity you will have beautiful beings around you beautiful beings around you you do not know the joy of having integrated and authentic people around you so first thing find your root thought pattern help others to find their root pattern and complete with it 
complete with it understand the lack of integrity and authenticity will not work in your life when you are inauthentic you forget things when you are not listening you forget things when you help people to complete their root pattern you will have authentic beings integrated beings you will be successful your mission will be successful your job will be successful everything everything will be successful essence of today's satsang is find your root pattern and complete with it jivan mukti pradam devam shama purnam jagat guru vande paramaham sakhyam nityanandaya swagatam ananda anubhava swadam sarva rog nivarakam vande paap vinashaktam nityanandaya swagatam let you all achieve experience live express radiate share and explode in eternal bliss ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಧ್ಯಾನ ಪೀಠಂ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ನಗರ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೈಸೂರು ರೋಡ್ ಬಿಡದಿ ಬೆಂಗಳೂರು ಫೋನ್ ಜೀರೋ ಏಟ್ ಜೀರೋ ಟೂ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಟೂ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಡಬಲ್ ನೈನ್ ಡಬಲ್ ನೈನ್ ಡಬ್ಲ್ಯೂ 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 ಡಾಟ್ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಡಾಟ್ ಒ ಆರ್ ಜಿ ಡಬ್ಲ್ಯೂ 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 ಡಾಟ್ ಯೂಟ್ಯೂಬ್ ಡಾಟ್ 